hi friends welcome back to my channel welcome back to Yan's diary and in today's video I've decided to try all the lipsticks that I own including a lip gloss of course so here they are so if you guys are interested keep watching So before I apply my first lipstick, let me moisturize my lips with a chapstick to prevent the lips from seeming too dry underneath the lipstick. So the first lipstick we're gonna try is by NK Makeup and it's in the color Bayberry. And the number is NKB02. So it comes in this neat little packaging. The basic lipstick packaging. And let me see now. Let me apply and tell you how it feels. I love it. Feels silky smooth. A lot. It requires a lot to to spread. It is before you guys go on the street and sure that there is no lipstick on your seats or on the corner. Okay, mom, that's not true. So this is how it looks. What you guys think about this? And if you wish to emphasize on the outline of the lips, you could always use your eyeliner pencil or a lip liner. I'm using dark brown just to give the lip a more defined look. This will give me first date look. It feels silky on the lips and because I apply the moisturizer as well it doesn't feel dry and uneven this is not a mattified lipstick though this can pass I'll give this a uh, 8 out of 10 what well, you guys give this one and if you want to give it a glossy appearance you could always use a lip gloss over it to enhance the look but otherwise it's a go so this one is approved <laughs> all right so let's go on to the, the next so let me just remove this one moisturizer again In essence, the moisturizer is just to protect my lips. Given that it is it that I am sensitive to the ingredients, it wouldn't cause any adverse reaction really. I have sensitive skin. So the next lipstick that we'll try is strawberry the color strawberry and this has the number NKB01 and it's also by NK makeup same packaging so let me apply this tool requires a lot to coat the lips Kind of a greeny, greeny effect. This looks good. It doesn't smell bad as well. Just have a typical 
<laughs> Lipstick smell. Not known to the ordinary. I thought it would have at least smell like a strawberry. You know, some lipstick, it says based on the color, it gives the scent but are they the flavor but this doesn't have it so this is how it's looking vogue let me give it some vogue also when you apply your lipstick ensure that the inner part of the lips also have the part that exposes when you speak this and put it on just to cover that area right so this looks good this is a red look oh it goes well with my complexion as well and my dark skin looks good let you guys get this one with this one, hmm, I will give this color a 7. I will give this color a 7 out of 10. What do you guys think about this one? 7 out of 10, right? Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Since this lipstick is the same brand, let me try it without applying moisturizer first to my lips and see the texture so this one is raw chocolate that's the color of raw chocolate I wonder if you could see and it has the number NKB09 raw chocolate so this is how it looks so let me apply it And it feels really good on the lips silky smooth <laughs> and it it's I think it fits it fits my complexion this could go with my complexion guys what you guys think about this one I'll definitely give this one a 9 out of 10 it's different it's um it's giving me a vibe like something unique nine for me definitely nine and it goes well with my black outfit so it gives you a sultry a sultry vibes for you guys so if I had done like some smoky eyes and probably put on some more bronzer highlights this would just give you the Ugh. and what about the eyelashes if I had to put on eyelashes as well it would have looked uh, much better so the next lipstick is this one and it's by Sasha Cosmetics and I've had this one for a long time so <laughs> the color start um, wash out so it says something nude it says something nude <laughs> So that will show you how much I love this one. I've had this for a long time. This one has a nice smell as well. I love this one for me. I'll give this one a 9 out of 10. It's hard to find nude that fits my complexion so then definitely yeah on to the next one this is the fifth lipstick but it's from a different company this one is from absolute New York and this one is in the color nightshade so let's try this lipstick so the packaging awesome and you could bring it up to what you would like to use and it's less at risk for breaking it off you know sometimes when you have to bring up too much of the lipstick sometimes you accidentally push too hard and it just broke off <laughs> well this 
protects the, the lipstick itself. So I love this packaging and it's really easy to hold. Let's apply now. By now with the application and the wipe off, the constant wipe off my lips, my lips are dry so probably I should have used the moisturizer before applying this one. Nonetheless, let's just see how this one comes out. I really love this pigment. It's like a purpley look, purple red look. Who is she? I love this. And the brown, dark brown eyeliner just give it a buzz. It just make it give it enhance the look. I love this. I love this one. By now you guys should know which one is my favorite. Yeah, this one. Especially with the lip. Oh god. <laughs> oh, this is cute. This is nice. What do you guys think? Tell the truth. It the thing look good. And it's mattified. It just bring up the look. It just make it look uh, um, elegant. Not even elegant, it make it look desirable. This give me a desirable look. Like, uh, <laughs> I love this one, honestly. For this one, for this lipstick, I'll give it 10 out of 10, most definitely. And can I tell you, this is my favorite lipstick to wear. I love this one, 10 out of 10. Now, let's remove this one and try the next one. The next one is from the same company, Absolute New York. But it's in a bold and bronzed. Bold and bronzed. I love the name. Same packaging. So let me now apply it to my lips. Yeah, this lipstick. This one, I love this one as well. It's a different shade of nude. But I would prefer the Sasha Cosmetic Nude. This one is nice as well, you know, but this one is more so could wear on a day, daily basis. Like if you're running to the supermarket or you're going to work and you just want something to keep your lips moisturized but still give it a, a color, a light natural color. Yeah, that's the word, a natural color. This is it. So this one really looks good as well. So with this one, I'll give this one, hmm, I'll give it a uh, 9. This one is definitely an everyday wear. This is nice. So you guys could consider getting one of these. And again, old and bronze. Very natural look. I love this. Okay, on to the next. So let me just remove this. So now we're on to the final. Well, this one is a lip gloss and it's by the same NK makeup. And uh, this pigment is A84 Bossa Nova. So let me try this one. This is the final lip gloss lipstick. <laughs> So this is the color, it looks or fuchsia. It kind of have a look of fuchsia look to it. Mm. Alright, let me try it on. This one applies so smoothly and easily across my lips. And it spreads evenly, quickly, very quickly. And it has a moisturizing effect to it as well probably because it's a glass yeah so it will be much easier to distribute across the lips but this is it I love this as well this 
one is cute as well. How much I think I give this one? A 10? Give it a 10? Alright, yeah, we'll give this a 10 as well. This one is a cute color. And again, these colors really enhance the look. I love it. I love this one for me as well. <laughs> That's how I have them. So guys, we have come to the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to drop a comment in the section below which of the lipsticks were your favorites. And don't forget to drop a like if you enjoyed the content. And subscribe, of course. See you guys in the next video. Bye.